Hi, my name is Emily Glasser, and I'm going to talk to you today about the Hannibal Central School District Technology Plan. Have you ever experienced the frustrations of not having enough computers for all of your students in your classroom, or not having enough knowledge on technology itself to feel comfortable implementing technology into your lessons? Well, the purpose of this technology plan is to extend on the great work that the Hannibal School District's Technology Committee has already done, but we're going to add more technology resources and professional development opportunities for the district staff to use. The following plan was completed based on a needs analysis of the district and will serve as a guided plan for future technology implementation. Hannibal serves three different central New York counties, over 100 square miles, with one elementary school, a middle school, and a high school. According to New York State's data from our 2014-2015 school report card, over 68% of our population is categorized as economically disadvantaged. That means these students may not have access to technology resources at home. The vision of our technology plan involves implementation of additional computer hardware and an added district technology specialist. Some of our goals are to provide each school with three additional shareable carts of either laptops, Chromebooks, or iPads over the next three years. Provide monthly opportunities for all of our staff members to participate in school-wide and district-wide technology training, and to hire at least one additional technology specialist whose focus will be that training um, by the next school year. So the technology that we currently have are seven computer labs over the the entire district. We have at least one desktop computer in each classroom. That desktop computer is generally a teacher computer that's connected to a projector and a smartboard. The high school has full four mobile laptop carts and two iPad carts. The middle school has two laptop carts and one iPad cart. And the elementary school has eight laptop carts, but those only have 10 laptops each, two iPad carts, and 15 Nexus 7 tablets. We put out a needs analysis survey to the teachers in the district, and based on their responses, we've come up with these four priority needs. The first is that students need more exposure to technology at an earlier age. The second is staff needs more training. The third is that the district needs more technology resources. And the fourth is that the pre-existing technology that we do have needs updating. And as you can see here in one of the sample questions from our survey, all but one of the teachers that participated felt that technology was very accessible, while the others felt it was only somewhat accessible. So we've come up with three main solutions. The first is to hire an additional technology specialist, and this will be somebody who preferably has a background in education. This person may be able to offer co-teaching, um, resources with teachers, or to provide small and large group training. The second solution is to purchase more technology, of course. And our district has decided that Chromebooks are more affordable than laptops, as well as faster. Um, they don't provide storage space, but our district recently switched over to being um, a Google school, if you would say. And we just don't need the storage that laptop computers have to offer anymore. Um, we'd also like to implement iPads because teachers have expressed that they still like to use tablets in their classrooms. And the third solution is to update and continue maintenance on the existing technology hardware. A few of the teachers expressed concern about headphones not working or little things here and there that could be easily fixed if we kept up with routine maintenance. So the timeline for this is by next year to hire a full-time educational technology specialist. And over the next three years, so by the end of the 2018-2019 school year, the district will have purchased three mobile iPad carts, one per year, and that will be one total iPad cart for each building. And the district will also have purchased six mobile Chromebook carts, two per year, and that would add an additional two Chromebook carts per building. Here's the proposed budget for the next three school years. Um, as you can see, we have a total uh, for each year as well as a total for the three years combined. The funding that we get for these resources is based on where we have received funding in the past. And that um, salary you see there is does include an additional salary for the technology specialist that we would like to hire. My sincere hope is that you take this 
plan into consideration. And if you have any questions, please feel free to contact me. Again, my name is Emily Glasser, and I'll be more than happy to discuss this plan further with you. Thanks so much, and thanks for listening.